curry corn. Now, if you never tried this before, today's the day that you get some corn and step in the kitchen with me because we're going to be currying up some corn. And this is so delicious, you guys. It will probably be your new favorite side dish. All right, so these are the main ingredients you're going to need. Your corn, of course. And you want to make sure you wash and cut those up into inch thick pieces. And, of course, you need your curry and you need coconut milk right so i'm adding a little bit of oil to my pot and i'm gonna fry the curry and you need to fry curry whenever you're using curry because if you don't your belly gonna hurt you and we don't want that right so i'm adding some curry in there along with some a little bit of peppers and onions and i'm just going to fry up the curry for a couple minutes about three to five minutes All right, then you want to go ahead and add your corn pieces to your pot. Mix that in. And then I'm using one can of coconut milk. And for reference, I did um, have five whole corn that I cut up in there. And I'm using one can of coconut milk. And then I added um, some pimento peppers or seasoned peppers as we call it in the Caribbean and some onions. I used about half of an onion and I filled the same coconut milk can, added some water. Just going to mix that in and of course at this point you want to add a little bit of salt and taste to see if it's fine for your liking. Add a little bit of salt, mix that in there. then i added a little bit more water and guys this might be controversial but i added a little bit of sugar um it's just gonna balance off everything and enhance the sweetness from the coconut milk and i also seasoned up my pot with a little bit of all-purpose seasoning and then i'm just gonna add some pepper thyme cover that down and let that do its thing okay All right, after about 20 minutes, I went in with a little bit of that creamed coconut. I wanted a little bit more of that coconut flavor without adding any liquid. So I added a little bit of that um, creamed coconut. I'm just going to stir that in. And I also wanted my... Um, corn to be a little bit more yellow so i'm adding a little bit of turmeric powder in there i didn't want to add any more curry i just wanted it to be a little bit more yellow and add a little bit more flavor so i'm adding some turmeric powder mix that in there and it gave it the perfect color that i wanted And to finish off, I just chopped up two garlics roughly and I'm going to add a tad bit more water, just about a cup or so of water more and just cover that down and let it keep going. And once that most of that water has evaporated, then we good because we want to have a little gravy in the corn too, you know gonna have a little bit of gravy in the corn so i'm just gonna mix that in and we're gonna let that go for a couple more minutes about the next 20 minutes And there we have it, you guys. Curry corn. This was so good, you guys. I could have ate this whole pot of corn. Like, no joke. 
this was a fire i'm not gonna lie to you guys as usual i'm gonna list the ingredients and everything that you need to know in the description bar but trust me you guys you need to make this you can serve this up with whatever you like i served it up with rice and baked chicken and it was the perfect side <laughs> again thank you all for watching and i'll see you lovely people in the next one later